consider how to calculate the length of an arc. If the central angle is in degrees, then we are going to use this formula. But if the central angle is in radians, then we are going to use this formula. The circumference of a circle is the total length if we unroll it. Any length short of the circumference is known as an arc. Let's find the length of this arc. Step number one, consider the central angle. Here, the central angle is in radians. Next, for the length of an arc in radians, we are going to choose the right formula. If you substitute carefully, the length of the arc is 12.57 meters. Remember, the radius is in meters. We can achieve the same result using the degrees formula. In the formula, this is in degrees. However, this is in radians. To convert this, we are going to multiply it by 180 over pi. Pi will cancel out this pi. 3 here is 1 and 3 here is 60. Computing carefully, we obtained the same answer. When the central angle is in radians and you have to use this formula, then you must learn how to convert. Else, you have to use this formula. Next, let's find the length of this arc. The first step is to consider the central angle, which is in degrees. Next, choose the right formula for central angles with degrees. If you substitute and solve carefully, the length of the arc is 43. 0.99 centimeters because the radius is centimeters. Let's repeat the question using the radians formula. The radius is 8 and the angle is 315. But in this formula, this angle is in radians. However, the question is in degrees. To fix this problem, we are going to multiply the angle by pi divided by 180. If you solve carefully, you are going to obtain the same answer. If you must use the radians formula for a given degree, then you must learn how to convert. To convert degrees to radians, you are going to multiply by 180 divided by pi. Likewise, to convert from radians to degrees, you are going to multiply by pi divided by 180. Always remember this. If this video was helpful, don't forget to subscribe, like and share. To locate and assess other helpful videos, follow the link on the screen. I will see you in the next video lesson.